I love the Blades of Chaos. Don't get me wrong, Leviathan Axe is a great weapon. In every game, Kratos can use the blades from the beginning, but in Dead of Boy, he is forced to use the axe. But I am loyal to my blades, so I am gonna beat God of War without using the axe. Rules of the run are very simple, I, I cannot hit an enemy with the axe. So get yourself a comfortable seat, get some popcorns, subscribe to my goddamn channel and let's get started. Where the hell am I? What is this toy in my hand? It's not a weapon, it's a it was a tool of justice. So I used that tool to chop some wood. Then I burnt my wife. She was a very tough woman. So it will take some time to get her ashes. In the meantime, time to check my boy's skills. Can't even shoot a fucking deer! Goons in the woods attacked us. Part of my cool tool get it cool tool. Nice. I threw it away because I'm loyal to my blades. Then I used my hands to punch, legs to kick, punched some puppies. Did it like that. Boy was sad. So to cheer him up, I helped him kill the deer. Good. It was a great father-son moment. I was about to touch my son and this troll stole my meat. He punched the hell out of his legs, struck all his moves stylishly and gave him my crack therapy. I had very limited moves. I needed some experience. So I paired the hell out of this enemy. Used the XP glitch to max out all my rage and shield skills. Now I can beat everyone stylishly. No room for another wife's ashes on my skin because I already have my last wife and daughter's ashes. You get it. So I'm gonna carry her ashes in a royal bag. This royal bag also have gold engravings. It's a very nice place for my last wife. I was giving my boy some basic lessons. Weak again. And then that happened. Someone really interfered while I was teaching my boy. I was getting really mad and then there was this small boy. I thought you'd be bigger. Can't hear you from down there. What are you saying? My ears are still ringing. Talk to my hands. I think now I can hear. Wait, what? I had no idea what the hell was going on. I couldn't hear a thing he was saying. I was also dearly missing my flaming blades and suddenly I felt the fires of my blade inside me and then it began. Feeling tired. I just wanted to get to my home and hug my son because he just lost his mother and then this guy tossed a fucking mountain at me, explained his feeling for some reason, and after that, he reminded of me of a time when I had wings and I used to fly and glide, and I had healing powers. I was getting angry and hungry, so I punched the hell out of him and gave him my crack therapy. I was getting tired of giving crack therapy to everyone, so I took my son and started the journey to the mountains. We were going peacefully, but my nerd son got excited and made a mistake. We were in a tough situation, so I punched some attacks, parried some attacks, and then I met a witch. I love a what? She is a witch, boy. Just look at her face and her. I don't know what are those sticks? I had to stun her using my boy's first moves and first arrows. After that, I used my rage to make our path clear. But there was an obstacle. I was facing regular humans. 
I had my boy with me, can't use my rage on normies. So I gave them my punch therapy, showed them some godly moves, and then it happened. I tried to parry his attacks, but it didn't work. I realized he was not an enemy, he was a problem. To fix a problem, I need a tool. So I used my tool of justice and saved my boy from humans and zombies. My boy was shocked. I knew he needed emotional therapy. But I was only good at crack therapy and crack therapy is a physical therapy. I, I have no idea how the hell I'm going to do emotional therapy. Let yourself. I did fix him and then we met this blue dwarf. He needed my cool tool so I helped him. Then he told me he made my cool tool and wanted to upgrade it. That guy forced me to upgrade this cool tool. I did some cool moves. But I'm not gonna betray my life, my love, my blades of chaos for some icy bitch. After that we ran into a troll, used my rage and style to beat him, used my upgraded tool to give this guy some crack therapy and I was feeling hungry. I found an apple but it wasn't helping. So we went after some meat. At first my boy failed, but he got him in his second try. I was daydreaming about some tasty meats and then my boy was gone. I was trying to find him in thick fog, then ran into a beautiful woman and she did some beautiful magic. You're a witch. Wait, what? This lovely lady is a witch? And she is not a witch. You will carry him. So I helped this lovely lady and she showed her her true colors. But I'm loyal to my dead wives. But I love tattoos. So me and my son got matching tattoos, fisted some nightmares, got my talisman and started rowing to the lovely sea. Then my boy used his nerdy skills and figured out I trusted my boy and threw away my toll, but it didn't come back. Then a storm was approaching. Friend son gave my axe back. Blue one gave a blue stone to blue doors. Damn, my English is stretching here. You can open a magic door to he wanted to fight me, but I chose forgiveness hurt. over my lust for blood. And then you know I forced it? him Do to clean my tool. Then we killed some puppies, killed a witch, and on the top of the mountain there was an ogre. He told me something, tried to eat my son, but I didn't let him. So I threw my tool away, showed him who is the boss. Destroyed his crew and then I was heading proudly to our goal. Oh, we were proudly going to our goal. And here there was an obstacle. Some huge black cloud covered the mountain and blocked the path. Then the lady appeared out of thin air and proposed she got a solution. I knew she had a crush on me, but I'm loyal to my dead wives. She showed her magic, I pushed an entire temple and learned some new skills. We were in a new realm. Flying cockroaches was a pain in my butt. But wait, even though they have wings, I was easily able to throw them and they died. This place is so beautiful. My son had a mental breakdown and he was hearing things. No. But I was having a blast. Then we solved the puzzle, got into a new area. We saw their leader. He had some big horns. After some time, that guy tried to kidnap my boy. So I used my rage, used my stool, used my rage. 
again used my tool unsuccessfully and killed his partner using my bare fucking hands. We were in war. I didn't need any weapon. Everything was going smoothly using my hands. But then this happened. How the hell I'm going to kill an ancient stone using my fist? So I used my rage. After killing him, I solved some puzzles that broke into their headquarters. I went through them stylishly, grabbed my boy and took the shortcut. It was risky but it was fast. I gave my tool to my boy. He was happy. I was also happy. I didn't really use that anyway. Then I used my hand to broke into the light. I was going to touch my dead wife but my boy didn't allow this. No, no. What have you done? I was Why angry you but that? then I, I took a look around. What the hell? My boy is a pro when it comes to use my tool. Feeling proud, I upgraded his bow. After some more punching, we finally got ourselves around common people. They didn't even thank us. Hug me, but there was no room for negotiations. I used my rage, my style, some sick dodges. After killing him, I got some sick mobs for my son, some three unique puppies, showed him how much I love my wife, traveled back to Midgard and after that went straight up to the mountain using Sindri's elevator, used the torchlight to get into the mountains, moved a mountain, then used the elevator thingy to reach pretty high. Then my son got emotional. He showed how much he thinks of her mother. He misses her mother. Then he made me feel something too. I was missing my blades. And then I, my wife. What did you write? I asked them to watch her mother. Then we used another elevator, killed some enemies using my fists, and a dragon surprised at a class. I used my shield to block and used my hands to punch. After that, the baby dragon was scared and ran away. He tried to hurt my baby boy, there's no room for forgiveness. So I ran like hell, threw his back, jumped and smacked his head with my toe. Then he tried to eat both of us, so I pushed my son boy away and just got into his mouth. Then I gave the toothpicking therapy using my tool. I just threw my tool away to use my hands. And finally this happened. I was feeling badass. Then I ripped one tooth out using my hand and then I used it to help uh, my son. I am such a great father. I am the father of the year baby. Then we beat some cultists because I am the god here. Who the hell are you worshipping? Smashed them, helped my kid and after some more smashing we reached the summit. We found here Mr. All-Knowing. He said he wanted to be free, and we are on the this wrong the path. Bridge to the winds of fate have up Since he was the All-Knowing, I asked him, only one Is there any way that can I can use my go. blades again? And luckily for you, Ymir then said, my Cut my head off, Every take me on your group, single. and I will help you. So he cut off his head and gave it to Freya. The second he came back to life, he uncovered the truth of the lady. She was a goddess. Oh. 
now i understand why oh, she was trying to seduce me because she is a god i am a god and we can make baby god as far as i'm concerned death suits you but i am loyal to my wife so i said to her goodbye called my grandchild again and he helped me he put me on the right path such a cute boy then we were said we are going to see santa i asked him who the hell is santa mimi said santa grants wishes Being a lovely husband I am I wanted to wish back my wife's I was excited my boy was excited and then we saw the hard truth I was full of rage so I decided to take my rage out on some human and dogs destroyed Iron Man North edition with my parry and fisting skills punched some nightmares punched some monkeys use my tool on a monkey and on sindri had some fun with the tanky man but after all this i was still feeling angry so i decided to destroy everything Finally I was feeling good. I was close to my goal and then this happened. Uh oh yeah. Boy. Surrender. The old father the I used my sick dodges, stylish combat skills and the rage of loneliness on them. I was missing my blades but I was stuck with this tool. So I used the tool deeply on Magnus face. Body was shocked then my boy made me proud. Then we used the key to break some doors. and finally reached our goal but wait yeah, yeah. what's that Sounds smell like oh. 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 my boy tried to copy my move but failed really hard then i showed him how a real god does it my boy was sick to came to the only girl i knew because girls are healer in common sense and common norse she told me to go to hell i was kind of surprised of course how can someone joke in a situation a like this then she explained the keeper that protects the bridge of the damned i need its heart i was sad for my boy but i was finally feeling kind of warm inside i stepped on the girliest boat i can found in midgard I was thinking all the glorious moments with me and my blade that finally I fisted some cool guys for the last time and then this happened after killing everything with my bear hairs for the last fucking But couple of days or no couple man. of hours in my case i can finally use the weapon that is so close to my heart so close to my passion and then i used it i used it wholeheartedly i was very happy i was oh feeling god. the blades and the rage and the fire oh my god oh sorry i am the god here oh, it was it guys If you want to see the blade only part 2 let me know in the comments this is my first time making this kind of video if some of you like 2 or 3 maybe 
watch this whole video. Thank you. I really respect you guys for watching this whole video.